make a video. Uh, yeah, you know, I'm gonna go make a video. I gotta just go to the bathroom first. So, yeah, the video. <sighs> Time to make a video now. Hey, Siri! Dang it. Hey, Siri. What time is it? It's 12.28 p.m. Perfect time for a video. Right smack dab in the middle of the freaking day. Should probably do a video. Uh, I should probably do a game. I should probably do a um, game. Uh, let me see. What do they have? You know what, uh, I, you know what, how about we search, how about, uh, we search for something that's going on with, like, the Five Nights games, like, Five Nights at Candies, you know what, I should probably do another Five Nights at Candies video, uh, here. Five Nights at Candies. Search what's going on. Five Nights at Candies official. Uh, Five Nights. Whoa, whoa, whoa! What the? What? Five Nights at Candies remastered? Five Nights at Candies remastered. Five Nights at Candies four. Oh. I actually want a Five Nights at Candy's 4. I actually want to play a Five Nights at Candy's 4. Ooh, creepy. 100% truly terrifying. Yep. Uh, here, let's see, let's see what this Five Nights at Candy's Remastered crap is all about. Uh, Five Nights at Candy's Remastered, official by email Ace Mako. He freaking made it. He freaking did it. He did it. Uh, alright. I uh, got it. I don't care. Uh... A little bit of creepiness right there. Uh, you know what? No, no company is without a rival. Freddy Fazbear's new pizzeria has closed for good. And so another restaurant is going to take its place in the world of entertainment. What could go wrong? This could go wrong. <laughs> <clears throat> this is Five Nights at Candy's Remastered, a game remade for the fourth anniversary of the Five Nights at Candy's game and series. This game does not work well on order on older hardware. I bet it wouldn't run on my old crap computer. Or this. I I, I don't think it would run on this. I just got an idea. Try to run Five Nights at Candy's Remastered on this piece of crap yeah 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 let's let's uh let's just <laughs> oh yes that's gonna be absolutely amazing uh ow This message is transmitted at the request of DV's brain and DV's nerves. Hand injury warning for DV's left knuckles. Pain level is 4 out of 10. Effective until 12.35 p.m. Central Daylight Time. Big Bottle B Productions. That hurt. The most notable difference between this remaster and the original game is that the graphics have been updated, uh, have been upgraded to a whole new level. Technical nerds among you will love to know that all the game's 3D renders have been re-rendered in Blender cycles. With this, models have been polished and all materials slash textures have received an upgrade as well. The game's code has been rewritten entirely, hopefully ensuring better performance and stability. This also means that I have the that I've had the opportunity to rebalance the game a little bit, though the mechanics are all the exact same 
as before. Please do not decompile or rip assets from the game! If you must do it, then go to the nearest uninhabited island and make sure you turn on airplane mode so nobody else gets spoiled. Or wait a week or two after the game is released. The entire restaurant will know how to play. Um, I already know how to play. Wait, what? He has a YouTube channel? He has a YouTube channel. Here, let's check that out. Let's check that out. Um, waiting for everything to load. Let's check it out. Five minutes of candies. Two trailer. Okay, let's see. Let's see what did, did did he upload any new videos? Tumblr. Um. Do not re-upload this video. You can do. Show the video in your own video, but you can't just re-upload the. Um. He didn't. Uh. You know what? Ending theme. He made an OST. Where is FNAC 4? Transmission. Is this supposed to be like the FNAC 4 crap? Blanks beat. Modeling Toy Freddy. You know what? I, I don't even care if he didn't upload crap. Let's just, uh, oh, four years ago. Let's just do that. Do that. And, uh, work <clears> hard. <throat> um. Yeah, uh, let's just uh, download that. Liked it? Share it. Oh God, find it to Candy's three. And uh, yeah, that's gonna take a long time. <sighs> All right, I've been tooling around with my computer for like an hour. Um, Let's see how good uh, this 3D render is, and my headphones are extremely dumb. Yeah. I thought, yeah, I'm gonna get ready for, I'm gonna prepare a video. Uh, now I'm gonna get the camera just right. Hey, what's up, Dab Squad? I'm DV, and today we are going to be playing Five Nights at Candy's Remastered. It's got to be a whole lot better than the original Five Nights at Candy's, like, am I right? <laughs> okay, no, in all seriousness, uh, I was I was trying this out uh, before this video. It is actually really good. It's actually a really, really good game. Uh, I like I like it. I like it just a lot, I have this game. Nice. Like, am I right? Okay, no. Why, why, why do I keep on saying, like, am I right? <laughs> Alright. Uh, in all seriousness, though, this game, much better graphics. And you know what? I'm gonna make a video on trying to get the game running on this piece of crap with the Pentium freaking 4 and Windows XP. This piece of crap, I don't think this. I wonder if this piece of crap will run it. You know what? Even more so than I think about it, I think that the Windows 98 machine. No, the Windows 98 machine's not gonna run it. It won't. It won't run on less than. Uh, I don't believe it'll run on less than like 700 and some megabytes of RAM. I think you need at least, or at least like one gigabyte of RAM to run it. <coughs> As my even thick pad. Well, I'm right. This has this computer right here, the the piece of crap that I just talked about, the Pentium Four. I just call it the Pentium Four machine. Has one and a half gigabytes of DDR one RAM. DDR one, not 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 DDR two, not DDR two like this other like the other computer was not DDR two. Not DDR3, which is what my main computer tower uses. This is a piece of DDR2 RAM. Does not use this RAM. I don't, I don't, I don't want to shut down my computer just so I can take a stick of RAM out of it. Plus, I'm sure that would F up a lot of the settings. Got the DDR2 RAM. All right.
I need to change what thing I record in. I need to change it from MP4 to like FLV. Output. Video. Advanced. Direct 3D11 is a renderer. You know what? I'm gonna be back after I change some stuff. Uh, see y'all in a second. I am now recording in uh, FLV format. Format. Hopefully, it'll be. Hopefully, the quality will be a lot better than usually what it is because I usually record it in MP4, so I can chuck it in the Windows Movie Maker. But now I'm changing that because I have Power Director 15. Uh, yeah, just just to make sure it does not lag down my computer. I'm gonna. I'm just gonna close Power Director. Uh, yep. That is mint. Uh, yeah, let's get into this game. And I'm gonna be, uh, playing the original. Wait, I'm gonna be playing the original, and then I'm gonna be, er, I'm gonna be playing the remastered. Then I'm gonna be playing with the original. Uh, yeah, so let's, uh, get on with that. Uh, let me just, uh, open up the game here. <clears throat> And, uh, warning, this game contains flashing lights, loud noises, and a reasonable amount of jump scares. Headphones are advised. Yeah, it's got, like, this cool, like, freaking like, TV screen effect. I, I, I wonder where I can get that font. I, I've had to get it off, like, um, here, let me take a print screen of it. Let me see if I'm going to be able to paste it in paint. MS Paint. Gonna paste. And yep, that's gonna work. God. Don't save. We're gonna go back here. Yeah, see, I, I I was tooling around with it. I completed the game. But we're gonna start it as a new game. Just because I want to help Wani Candy Burgers and Fries family restaurant looking for a security guard on night shift 12 a.m. to 6 a.m. $150 a week. Not responsible for any injury of any kind. First night, they forgot the 12 a.m. But, oh, holy crap, what, I think, what, was this, like, designed in, like, Unreal Engine 4? No, probably not designed in UE4. It's probably designed in, like, UE3, maybe, if that existed. Whoa, the, the voice sounds way different. Why, why, why is this on the computer? Yep. But, you know, it's protocol, so I have to walk through the basics anyway. Okay, they're bad. So, let's get started. We have security did they literally like change like every font in the game to that? Yes, he did. I mean, the graphics look a lot better, but the lighting is pretty bad. Especially in this room. This room, the lighting is probably like the worst. Everything else, the lighting is good. But they could use a little bit more of like an incandescent bulb look instead of like cold fluorescent lamps. Bring up the camera panel. Click on the button that says Cam 01, and then to use Night Vision, you click on Cam 01 again. Once Night Vision is activated, you can click on any of the other cameras to view them with Night Vision as well. And you turn it off the same way you turn it on. Now, Night Vision takes more power than regular vision, so make sure you use it sparingly. Your first priority as a security guard here is to keep an eye on the animatronic. There's stars well, across the ceiling, the and there's an extra and light. Do not want them stolen. And you keep an eye on them. We have quite a few animatronics here at the game. There's of course the cats, candy, and Cindy. There's the chest, the chimpanzee, and there's the penguins. Just lots, I tell ya. Uh, so, you also have three security doors in your office, each of which can be closed by pressing the door button by each other. These are here in case you're in some sort of danger, but personally, I just use them to shut myself off from the world when I get free. But don't let me be One penguin, on that one. two penguins, to that and there's one in here. Takes power. The longer they're closed, little ankle biters the more power they drink. now I know that sounds kind of backwards but you have to trust me on that one I think it's something about the doors having an automatic fail safe feature in case the power gets cut off you know so they open up if there's no more power all I know for sure is that they do <coughs> more and more power the longer they're closed so you don't want to keep them closed for too long at a time I wonder if uh, uh <coughs> the email is 
Remade the, made the voice acting. I bet they did. Which only has a certain amount of cues in it. So anything from viewing the cameras to using the security doors takes power. Yeah, that sounds like him. You can see how much power you have left on the computer on the desk in front of you. Try not to run out of power. If you do, though, you won't be stuck in the office since the doors will always open up anyway. Oh, and uh, one last thing. The animatronics aren't completely turned off at night, so they might start walking around a bit. But just be careful not to let any of them into the office, because we have stuff in there we don't want damaged or anything. Yeah, it's me. So don't bother with the ticket booth door. They won't attempt to get in through there. That should be all. You'll hear from me again on your next shift. Have well, blank night. will. Wait, they had an echo. I mean, it looks a lot more creepy, but why did they put a Christmas tree when it's August? They have palm trees here now. Just why? Also, what I want is I want the origami cat. I want the origami cat to come back. I wonder if he put it in there. Why are there Christmas trees in August? Oh, holy whoa! Look at his eyes, man! Look at his eyes! Holy crap! Yeah, I think they look better. I think they look best in that room. Just like the way that you can like see their eyes like that. They uh, he also kept the same like color affecting or the color effect from the original one. Yeah, you can see they got a little purple and they got a little green. <clears throat> oh, really? I think that's just red and turquoise. Just there. I was so slightly different shaded. They're too pale. They're not necessarily too pale. They're just too light. So then they got magenta and tur and green, which I believe is supposed to be red and turquoise. She's still there. They also added like composite cables and crap to the side. <laughs> like, look at that, man. They even had a USB. Or I wonder if that's just connecting to like the Wi Fi adapter or something. That's probably the power. That's either the power or that's the data in. Or no, no, that's the data in. That's the video. That's probably power. And that's probably just like vertical sync and stuff. And hello there, bud. I'm literally just scrolling through the cameras like a boss. I bet that's some sort of data cable. I bet I bet that small cable <coughs> is giving the um the room the room names. <coughs> but that's what that small USB is. It's probably mini or micro USB. Probably micro USB like the one used on Android phones. And then that's gotta be the power, because I don't think there'll be a big a cable. Other than the power on, since that was for the hard disk for the system software. And the hard disk is outside of it, and that must just be the monitor. I don't know. That seems like the data cable that would bring in, like, the room names and what's going on. Whoa, 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 50 a Oh, it's 5 a.m. Yeah, no, dog. Oh, wait, what? He's gone? Oh, he's there. I thought he was going to be, like, way down here or something. I wonder if he's going to be a Cindy copy machine again. I wonder if he's gonna be a Cindy copy machine, cause that's what he just did. He gets angry! It goes the other way when you call him a Cindy copy machine. <laughs> it's funny. Also, one thing that I discovered is that if Cindy is- Oh, whoa, whoa, what?! Why is Chester out on the first night?! Whoa, whoa, whoa there, bud! Is he- Yeah. Why is Chester out on the first night?! Like, what the frick? Chester isn't supposed to be out. Chester is not supposed to be out. Hello? Why? 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 Please? Tell me why? Where is Cindy? Cindy's still up there. I'm keeping an eye on ya. I really have to keep an eye on these two. I don't think Cindy... Oh, whoa, what? Why are you going to the office? You know what? Oh, never mind. Why was... Chester active on the first night. Did I click the wrong button? I think I clicked on the wrong button. Well, 
Well, they're mine. He's closer to the camera than usual. Hello. <clears throat> Did I click on the wrong button? No, I didn't. Why was Chester on on the first night? That's odd. Huh. Here, you know what? We're gonna Google it. We're gonna Google it. Goodbye. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you want to see more, if you want to see original content gameplay, like this video. If you want to see remastered content gameplay, still like this video. If you want to see more gameplay and more videos, hit the subscribe button and the notification bell to get notified whenever I upload a video. And also, if you want, uh, also comment hashtag notification squad to be featured. In the next video, or at least to get a shout out, not be featured, you'd have to come in uh, to my house to be a featured person in my video. But hey Siri, what time is it? It's 1 p.m. Dang, took a while. <laughs> um, yeah, it's pretty much all I have to say for this video. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Smash the like button. Hit that subscribe button. Punch it with your face or something. Just hit the subscribe button with your mouse. Um, turn on notifications because notifications you know what? It's actually proven that generosity makes you a better person. So if you, so if you, would be so generous, to go and just hit the big red subscribe button, that would help me out a lot. Also, if you would go and just, fun fact, when you hit the like button, it turns blue. Mind blown, am I right? <laughs> All right. Uh, no, seriously. By hitting that like button, you let the you. You let the YouTube algorithm know that this is good content. So, um, if every one of my subscribers viewed this video, we would get 64. We would get 64 likes. We would get or 64 likes slash dislikes or any combination of the two. We would get we would get probably a few extra likes if I got 64 likes in this video. We'd probably get an extra more some extra more likes and some more. Some extra more likes. Some extra likes on this video. And probably a few more subscribers, which would actually help me out a lot because I've been losing motivation to you to do YouTube lately because my channel has stopped growing and I'm starting to lose motivation because I have I, I don't have anything to motivate me anymore because there is no there's no um there's no growth on my channel. So there's kind of no reason. Plus, I, I usually only get like two video, two views on a video. So it means most of my subscribers don't care or they don't have notifications on. So, also, um, oh, people on YouTube just uploaded my video. Um, make sure to go subscribe to rgamer96. He is in serious need of motivation. He really, really needs the support, guys. Go, go to his channel. Search, just search rgamer96. Smash the subscribe button. And, uh, yeah. Goodbye.
Bray.